Rachel, I'm back. And I'm better than ever. State news crawling out of my dishwasher. I am definitely not passive aggressive about the fact that this was not in fact the Valentine's Day video. And I definitely didn't lose my hat. I've just misplaced it. Anyway, hello everybody and welcome to a random cooking video with Waluigi. So, couple things with today is that I am baking some cream goods and I'm currently on a medication that prevents me from having dairy within two hours of me having this medication. It's been an hour and 45 minutes. It's gonna be difficult to hold myself back. I am in fact wearing an apron which will cover up my cosplay half of the time, but it is needed. Cinch that waist. <laughs> What are we cooking today? We are cooking a couple of um, stuff that needs to be put into the fridge and freezer, such as we are making chocolate ripple cake. We are making ice cream. This is the best way I can describe ice cream. And we're making my arch nemesis that I haven't been able to make in the last, I think, two videos. I've tried to fucking make it. Crema de Cafe. Let's hope that I can actually fucking make it this time. Cause I will be whipping by hand. <laughs> Instead of, that was shit. That was shit. <laughs> Instead of a bottle, don't do that. Don't do either of those. <laughs> Both of those are bad. A lot of these are gonna take a lot of time. We've got black licorice. Did I say it was black licorice ice cream? Cause it's, 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 it's black licorice ice cream. Because I like black licorice. So, um, compare me to Satan all you want. I am a major villain. Thank you very much. Also, what do you mean I wasn't in the fucking Mario movie? I'll get my things first and get my thoughts together. Uh, I also, because it is stinking hot, have a tiny fan. But, uh, not important right now. I need to find this fucking recipe. Also, I didn't realize when I said one of my things would be ice cream that it wants me to use an ice cream maker. I will not be doing that because I don't have one. I feel like a fairy with this. <laughs> this just is a hand whisk, doesn't it? In a large bowl, use an electric whisker, beat cream until firm peaks form, line tray with baking paper, six biscuits prepared on tray, top each with one tablespoon. This wants me to make like mini ripple cakes. Um, I don't particularly want to make mini ripple cakes because it also wants me to add like cocoa and raspberries and all that sort of shit. I just want to make chocolate ripple cake. Just want to make chocolate ripple cake, which I'm pretty sure you literally do just by layering cream. Minimum of six hours to set. Cream, sugar, vanilla. Okay, we've got granulated sugar here. For those who don't know what chocolate ripple cake is, it is an Aussie classic uh, because we have chocolate ripple biscuits, which I kept throwing the fuck around, and um, made, you make cake with just cream. That's just, that's a block. That is a full block. How much caster? One teaspoon. I want one teaspoon of caster sugar. One teaspoon caster sugar for the cream. See, it's a good thing that I have three things here of cream that have been unopened. Should I leave these in the fridge? Probably. Smells fine. Do not want a fucking crema de cafe incident where most of the cream is fine. It's just that there's mold around the rim, which makes me not want to eat it. I also need a cake pan. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get baking paper. Foil is probably the smartest option. Um, I'm going to get wrapped up in this mic board. I'm just going to do it this way because I know this is a pan for baking, not for freezing or refrigerating, should I say? Okay, all of this is good. All of this is good. Uh, I don't know if the ice cream will need stiff peak, so I'll check the ice cream. I should just put these in the fridge and make sure they stay in the fridge. Same with the coffee. All of this can go in the fridge. Bastard. Rude fucking bastard. We want 
at least capful of vanilla. Love a cap, a little bit over a capful. I could make creme de cafe with that. I could do it. I could do it the way it's supposed to be. Okay, let's go. We're gonna whip. We're gonna whip this with a real good. Should be good. Oh, there we go. Stiff peaks. So, next in the chocolate ripple cake. Making process. You take your chocolate ripple biscuits. These are very small. I remember these being much bigger. We're gonna take a little spatula. Little spatula. And I'm going to partially line this, fuck off fly. I'm gonna partially line this pan with a little bit of cream and then put some biscuits on it. Just to stick them onto the bottom of the pan. Also because when it comes to these, they need to have cream on them to actually be mushy and turn into cake. So, he's standing. We standing up. Oops. And then you do something like this. Like make little ice cream sandwiches. How I'm gonna do this is I'm gonna smear both sides with cream. Um, and just sort of like try and stick them together. Bit more chunky cream. So once you have like, it's supposed to be longer, but I'm just gonna do like two logs instead of one big cake. But once you're done, you cover it in cream and it's supposed to absorb in the fridge and get all nice and moist. Don't, 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 don't. I know what you're thinking, don't. Do not, stop it. So I'll just do another row like this with some more cookies and I might even make a third. Uh, so this goes into the fridge for six hours. Six hours in the fridge. I can easily watch one Fills of Minecraft VOD <laughs> in that time. Our next thing. I'm gonna use this cream. I'm gonna fucking open it and smell it first. It smells fine, okay. Put a little bit of cream in that. I need powdered sugar for this. Tablespoon of icing sugar. I think that was too much. <laughs> Where is a plastic spoon? Spoon! Okay, so we're gonna mix the sugar in the coffee. Hopefully it mixes. Now it tastes very sweet. Okay, that is not gonna be enough cream, for the amount of coffee that I have. Okay. Um, so. That is sweet and bitter. Um, that is now mostly, mostly coffee. So we're gonna add a little more cream. A little more cream. That is definitely more than enough. <laughs> we're gonna try and whip it. We're gonna try and whip it. We're gonna whip it. Progress is being made. cup that I originally had it. Okay, so we're gonna pour this in. I think it's slightly over whipped. Only slightly though. We did it. It tastes like whipped cream coffee. <laughs> Now, I wouldn't necessarily have this as a dessert, but I would have it as like a topping. Like on our next dish, ice cream. So, how much water does it, why is this wet? Why is this wet? Wet, why? First of all, fuck you. Half a cup of water, okay. That's half a liter, where is a cup? Where is the cup? Where is the measuring device? That is a cup. Okay, so we want half a cup, which is that much. 
Okay, so in our prepping, we're going to, uh, what I've done is I've put egg yolks in here, which one of them's popped. Um, I've put the egg whites in here, which I'm gonna whisk up and turn into like a um, egg white omelet. Um, and now we are just preparing the licorice, AKA little wombat shits. <laughs> um, as you can see by the fact that they look incredibly like wombat shit, uh, especially in the way that I'm cubing them. Um, yeah, which doesn't seem appealing, but they are very nice tasting. Licorice, that is, not wombat shit. I wouldn't know from experience. I can only assume. So it says to cut it into small pieces. This is like as small as I can really get it because um, it is quite gooey. Again, 32 degree g'day, so it's like extra gooey. You have to wait until the licorice is completely melted and sort of make like a sauce. It's all been cut up. I'm gonna go put it in the mini saucepan and we'll melt it on that one. Tiny saucepan where we put our licorice. Uh-oh. Um, and the way I've cut it up it is basically 100 grams. It's not officially 100 grams. As much as I like licorice, I cannot deny that this does look like shit. Oh, my brothers are going to complain about the smell. <laughs> it smells strongly of black licorice, which both of them do not like. Mum won't be mad. My brothers will. I did say stirring occasionally, so I'm just going to try and move on to the um, milk. Stuff that I have to do. I have to wait until all of this is fucking melted. Okay. One cup whole milk. Um, I'm gonna struggle with the cream. <sighs> Ooh. This looks nice. Okay. This actually smells really good. I mean, if you like black licorice, it smells really good. If you don't, then you wouldn't like it as much. It's smoking! It's a witch's brew. Witch's brew! Of a low heat. Whoops. Um, I'm gonna feel so sick after drinking this. Okay, I actually genuinely can't tell if that's steam or if it's smoke. So I'm gonna leave it. Um, the milk is on the low heat. So I'll get started on the next part. Eggs and heart. A whisk. That seems whisked. So we add vanilla. There we go. Oh, that's too much. That was too much. Half a cup. Fucking hell. Okay. Um. So, due to some technical difficulties, um. The ice cream base is now mixed. Um, and it actually tastes very much like very sweet vanilla ice cream. And it says in a saucepan to combine. So we're just gonna put it all in here. So put on low heat and then we add our liquid shit. <laughs> this is gonna be very, very strong licorice ice cream. So I'm supposed to get it off when it like coats the spoon a bit. Okay, so the rest of the cooking is um, freezing and refrigerating. Uh, so I will do that off camera, obviously. Um, and yeah, so the next you'll see me, I'll be out of cosplay. I've, I've let this sit out for 20 to 30 minutes because rock solid, absolutely rock solid. Um, finally, I'm able to get chunks out of it. And I am conflicted. It doesn't quite taste like ice cream. It tastes like frozen cream. Despite the fact that I did everything to make it taste like ice cream. 
and for the first couple of hours it looked like soft serve and tasted like soft serve and then I left it because I was eating the ripple cake a lot it's not bad I could have done with less um licorice because there's like if you eat too much licorice there's an aftertaste are you getting that aftertaste if you have this because you have to melt it down and it's so much sugar and shit I now have to eat all of this not bad better execution is needed thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video i enjoyed making food eating food and being able to have dairy hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please let me know down in the comments below like and subscribe if you liked it and i will see you guys next week 10 a.m straight in eastern and i will see you guys then have you had an amazing day night weekend afternoon whatever time it is and i'll see you guys next time bye